How's it going, everybody? I'm back. It's been a little bit, but I thought I'd film an interesting little video about trust, and that's about it. So we have one person in particular who we're going to be trusting with about one to, well, one, well, we'll say 1.3 mil, uh, and this is the perfect account because it is a level 81 who is, it, it would be in their interest to scam me. Let's just say this. So I've been talking to this guy, but I'm making a YouTube video, d despite the fact. Hopefully he doesn't log on, because then I, I won't be uh, doing this video. But I've been talking to some people because I have some items listed in the auction house. This is my warrior, by the way, Spear Warrior, Imperial, level 200. OP as fuck. Uh, most OP account I've ever made. Pretty fun. Now, I have some items. You know, Mountain Ami, Ice Crystal. White Lanark top for 4.5 mil, which I've already I'm already getting shit for for it being overpriced. Look, I sold White Lanark pants for 4.5 mil. That's why I'm selling a White Lanark top for 4.5 mil. Get off my ass. I understand it's overpriced as fuck. I would probably sell it for 3 mil, no less, because my White Lanark pants I got a 3 mil gold offer, and then I I I ended up selling them for 75 chests, which I then sold for 4.5 mil. So, uh get off my ass I don't need to run my prices through you suck my dick uh, dragon egg 2.5 mil also kind of overpriced they're only really worth two fuck off uh, but then there's this the the wild grove amulet of the sun I'm trying to sell it for 1.25 mil which I've once again of course been hounded for oh it's overpriced it's only worth one mil fuck off um, so this guy uh, offered he mailed me um, yeah, this was the guy who was. Uh, this guy's actually nice. I'm. I'm just. I'm just playing. This guy wasn't. wasn't a dick or anything like a lot of people. Uh, usually are when it comes to ah, it's overpriced. Uh, you know, he was nice. So this guy, uh, Rue Valisar, uh, he offered six hundred and fifteen k and ten chests, and then I came back, and while I offered him, uh, I'll sell it to you for thirteen chests and six hundred and fifteen k. He said, deal. You have a deal. When and where do you want to make the trade? So this guy's not on at the moment, and I figured that I would just mail him the item and uh, see what happens. So if I just will show you real quick. He's level 81, and he, I don't even think he has full Moonshadow armor. Uh, so in terms of the non-liquid items of his account, it is basically worthless, right? It, 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 this item's worth 1.25 mil. His gold, his chests, his, he had like an offhand that's worth like 100k or something like that. That's all um, canceling that listing, voiding 50k. Gotta love it. Yeah, so we're gonna take this amulet and we're just gonna mail it to him and we're gonna see. Very curious because it's very easy to take level 220 and say, oh, let's see if he scams me. I'm going to give him two mil. It's like, of course he's going to fucking give it back. Because a 220 account with full EDL, all those levels, all that licksing, all that time, all that money in EDL armor and DL armor and, and potentially the offhands and Corrupted Garden offhand and, and all the things. It's like, yeah, no shit. The, the non-liquid value of the account. But this is different. This is a case where the non-liquid value of this guy's account is like what 10 lixes and like a couple hours level 81 rogue no moon shadow the the non-liquid value of this account is is very low uh basically nothing and i'm going to give him an item worth well this deal's suggesting it's worth about 1.3 mil something like that i don't should i make a threat <laughs> i am a youtuber beware <laughs> uh that might but even then, like, oh, so what? You're a YouTuber. I'll just fucking make a new account and no one will fucking know. I'll suffer no reputation damage and I'll lose out on, like, a level 81 account. Oh, I can't believe I'm doing this. You know what? I'm not even going to mention the scam me part. I'm just going to say, just mail me the golden items when you see this. You know, I'll be nice, even. I'll, I'll, I'll say, uh, Cheers. There, how could you? How could you scam that? How could you scam that? So, uh, oh God, this hurts. This hurts because, well, 
number one way to not get scammed is to uh, don't give away items to anybody without something in return. And we're breaking that rule. So, um... <laughs> Being a YouTuber for this game is hard. Because every video idea that I have is basically, oh, let's open Hawker's chests. Let's open regular chests. Let's see if this level 81 will scam me. Every idea that I have is basically, oh, let's lose some money. I mean, oh, let's dice. I lost 7 mil dicing. There's a fucking video, you know. Um, I have plenty of videos in the catalog that I've been having trouble with my editing software. So I might just upload this in whole. Well, I'll have to edit to see if... Uh, we ever hear back from this guy so yes what is his name again what's his name well, let's say uh, Rue Valasor I believe is the name Rue Valasor we'll see we'll see uh, if not I just uh, rip to to 1 mil rip to 1.3 mil but we're gonna see this guy, it, it's just like, if, if you're just going to think about the decision from a logical perspective, it just logically makes sense to scam me. Like, it, it just, it, it just makes sense. So, it's logically right. Will it be morally wrong? Who knows? We'll see. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll catch you back in, in, well, I'll catch you back whenever we get a mail or if I'm waiting for a couple days, then... Well, well, we'll also film that, so, yeah. We'll see you with the update resolution. Okay, how's it going, everyone? I am back. It is the, it, it's the next day, uh, so I just thought I'd give a bit of an update on uh, what happened. Um, sorry, my mouse is fucked up. Uh, okay. I thought I'd give a little update on what happened. Uh, I am very very happy to see I actually didn't get scammed which I was honestly surprised by uh, I started because it, it I just got this mail not that long ago uh, I woke up I, I went to bed and I woke up like 14 hours later uh, to check and I didn't have any mail and I thought oh no it's been 14 hours I was starting to, I was starting to lose confidence but there you go. He gave me the 615k and the 13 chests. Here you go. Uh, thanks for the trade. Rue Valisar. So uh, he did not have to do that. Uh, he had every uh, he had every reason to scam me, considering it would have been pretty goddamn anonymous. Um, it would have just made sense. I mean, he would have made about like a... Would have made about like a like a one one point three mil profit considering he's only level eighty one. I wonder if he's leveled up since level eighty five. So there you go, um, Ruvalisar. Uh, that's pretty cool. Didn't scam me. Not to say that that like clears. Don't go send him fucking ten mil or anything. But you know, um, didn't scam me. Clearly, uh, he, he's trustworthy with like a mil. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, just thought I'd do that. What's this guy talking about? Do you have two red urns so I can finish my EDL set? Mm. Nah, I don't. Sorry. Uh, I don't have anything like that. <clears throat> I know. So yeah, um, there is the conclusion to the video. We, I, I, I'm so happy. I, I am so, ooh, 3.5k each for this? Eh, I don't really need it. Yeah, no problem. Um, yeah, I know. I don't even need to check my uh, inventory to know I don't have... No, I don't have that. Uh, yeah. I am just... I am... I'm over the moon. I was, I'm was. i really happy, dude. Uh, it's, it's really nice to see somebody uh, stick to their... Uh, stick to their word. It wasn't even like... Well, yeah, I, uh, stick, to, stick to the word. And uh, there you go. There's the end of the video. Uh, actually, a, a good conclusion. Hopefully, this video maybe uh, makes you a little less... Uh, a little less... You know hateful to the world you know somebody could have scammed me easily 1.3 mil decent amount I mean, it's, especially for a new player that's a lot i mean 
being able to save 1.3 mil, shit, that's a, that would be a, quite valuable. Uh, so, there you go. Random stranger over the internet had every, um, was perfectly set up to scam me and never to be seen again, never to suffer any real consequence. Uh, held, held, held to his word. So there you go. I think that's the that that's the happy conclusion. That that's that is the happy conclusion that I wanted for this video. So uh, thank you uh, for not scamming me. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Didn't get scammed, so that's cool. Actually, sure. Okay, cool. Trustworthy with 40k. <laughs> yeah, this was the guy who was. Uh, this guy's actually nice. I'm. I'm just. I'm just playing. This guy wasn't. Wasn't a dick or anything like a lot of people. <laughs>